So I want to test the uh, connections for uh, the whole system, intake system from the turbo all the way to the motor to make sure there are no leaks. So what I've done is I've taken some uh, ABS uh, cap and I've drilled a hole in it for a fitting that will, f uh, I can put a regulator on here. And now I can uh, take an air hose get the boost up to 30 psi to make sure that it's going to hold and uh, if it doesn't hold then uh, I need to get better clamps or uh, put some flares on my uh, intake system so right now what I can do is take some um, soapy water and I can spray it on all the joints and I can double check to make sure that uh, it's not blowing air out anywhere Okay, so the reason that blew off of there, uh, this is a this is a factory. Uh, um, I don't know what you call that bead. Uh, there's a factory uh, bead roll around here, so that prevents the hose from coming off. But on the other side, I don't have one, and that's what let go. So uh, I think I have a good solution for that in making one. So. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I uh, got a pair of these um, cutter crimpers from Canadian Tire. So what I want to do is uh, modify them slightly. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to cut off. I'm going to cut off everything above that line, just like that. So I'm going to use this little that little part there. You see it? I'm going to use that little part there to make a bead around that uh, aluminum tubing. Sawzall blade. So I'll um, let's see. Oh, there we go. All right. Uh, so that's now off. And uh, let's see. have ourselves a, a nice little bead going around there so it should do that all the way around and that should prevent the hoses from popping off at high pressure <laughs> 